Thank you for taking the time to view the HG Analyst software overview. If you're running HG Analyst on a 64-bit operating system, the first time you run it, you'll need to right-click on the icon and run as administrator. You should only have to do this the first time. HG Analyst software is a real-time data acquisition, data log collection, and email alert software package for use with the VM3000, the Mercury Tracker 3000, and 3000 IP Mercury Vapor Analyzers. We have our computer connected to the instrument via the RS-232 port. We're using a USB to serial adapter to connect it to this laptop. Once you have your cables connected, simply go to File, Connect, the computer will recognize the COM port in which the instrument is connected to. Click OK. And we're now collecting data in real time. As you can see here, we have a real time graph that's being drawn. Below that, there's a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet that's being continuously generated. That Excel spreadsheet consists of the measurement number, the time, the date, and the instrument's reading. Over here on the right side, we have the real-time reading, the time of the run, the overall history, which gives us an average for the entire run, as well as the highest peak for that run. It will also break down and give us the one-minute history and the five-minute history which includes averages and peaks for those time frames. At any time during the run, you can go to File and Save, and this will save a copy of the Excel spreadsheet that's being generated. For now, we'll just call it Test with the Date. This will allow you to simply go in here and open the Excel spreadsheet with the current run. This is the measurement number, the time, the date, and the concentrations. One of the main features of HG Analyst software is the email alert system. To configure your email alert system, simply go to configure alerts. In here you can add the email addresses in which you'd like the alarms and alerts sent to. I'll simply add my email. You can add as many as you'd like. Now to configure the alarms here, we have a simple measurement threshold alert. This will send you an email alert if the instrument breaches the pre-desired threshold. So we'll set it to 30 micrograms per cubic meter and click Add. Now if the instrument reaches 30 micrograms per cubic meter or greater, it will automatically send everyone in your email alert system a message. It will also send the peak of that if you'd like, or you can select that so you just receive the alert. If you select that on, it will send you two alerts. It will send you one with the alert that is notifying you of a breach of that concentration as well as what that reading was on the high end. We have an average threshold alert monitor. This will send you an email alert if your readings are an average, let's say over 20 micrograms per cubic meter for a five minute period. This will also generate the automatic peak after the alert. So it will send you the alert and then you'll get another email with the peak. Here's our average monitor. And what this does is it will send you an automatic email, let's say every five minutes, with the average for that five minutes. And our periodic peak monitor, say you want to look at the peak for every 10 minutes. This will send you an email for every 10 minutes or whatever you so desire. Uh, with the peak for, the la for that last 10 minute worth of run time. We also have the ability with HG Analyst to send you an Excel spreadsheet. 
you can have it sent from every one to five hours. It will send the entire spreadsheet that's being generated through that run. So if we'd like to receive a spreadsheet every two hours, to, and we'll just call this test sheet. You'll just put in there the two hours, the name of what of the file, and uh, just click OK. So let me show you how this alarm looks. So we'll breach the 30 micrograms per cubic meter here. See, we got to 36. I'll open my email. There it is. So this gave us our periodic peak average. Here was the breach, the alarm breach. So this gives us the peak of that run, as well as the average, the peak, the overall average. Often these alarms will get sent to your junk mail unless you add the no reply HG analyst support email address to your safe folder. So here's the original breach, 35 micrograms per cubic meter at 1120. Shortly after that it followed with the peak. So we knew that it breached that concentration, but in the highest part of that was 36. And then it also sent out one of the other alerts that we had was to receive the periodic peak average, the highest average, as well as the overall average. Which at this time are all the same. Now another benefit of HG Analyst software is you're able to collect your data logged file into the same software package. I'm just going to remove the email so that we don't receive uh, emails from the data logged file unless you'd like to. So we'll simply just close this. Now if you have log data available in your instrument, you want to go to the logger menu, connect your instrument to the computer. Once you open the software, you'll just want to Say file and connect. As you can see, we're not recording any data in real time because the instrument is sitting in in non-measurement mode in the logger menu. So from here, we have it connected. We'll simply select send data to PC from the instrument. And this will import the entire log file. As you can see, it imported the date and the time from when these measurements were taken. So this allows us here to simply save this spreadsheet. So we'll save it. And then we'll have our log test file. And here's our entire data log file, which gives us the measurement number, a date and timestamp for each individual reading, as well as the concentration. This will allow you to generate and make nice reports. Here at Mercury Instruments USA, we'd like to thank you for taking time of watching the software overview. You can download a free 30-day trial from our website. And if you have any questions or you'd like to discuss this on the phone, please feel free to give us a call at 303-972-3740.